What's going on boys and girls? Kip Campbell here from Red Arrow with another hunting tip for you. This hunting tip has to do with using bait and some other little tricks to get that deer broadside for a clean ethical bow kill or gun kill for that matter. But you see people hunting over bait all the time and they just got a big corn pile out there, some pile of big attracting or whatever, and that deer can move and take his body 360 degrees around that bait. This right here, this little trick, just throwing two logs in a V-shape will get you that deer broadside perfect where you want to shoot it every time. So if my stand location is over here, my bait pile is right here, I back it up against a stump or a tree, throw two logs making a triangle, that deer's naturally going to work his way in here and put itself broadside right where I need to shoot him. Now, this is something that I use a lot in, in states where you're allowed to bait in for the kids. So... It's just a real easy way to get that deer to hold still. And when he's holding still, eating that bait, he's perfectly broadside. Um, you can also use this in places you can't bait. I've done the same thing with brush piles. So like you take a tree that's falling down behind me right here. You can strategically drop trees and throw brush in areas to make that deer divert. You might have a trail that that deer likes to walk down where he's hard quartering away. And he's like 35, 40 yards when he takes that trail. Well, drop a couple trees in it and manipulate his path where he has to walk by your stand 20 yards broadside. So you need to kind of think ahead on especially stand setups that you're going to hunt time and time again. And you can use the structure around you to divert the deer's movement so you can make a clean shot on them. 